fill issues and most notably a violent storm that knocked down branches across town. Still, Mayor Stothert says that's no excuse for the long delays and pickups. One day delay because of the holiday, we expect it. Um, two days because of a storm, perhaps, but now we're talking three and four days. That's just unacceptable. Waste management has been playing catch up ever since a Tuesday morning storm knocked down literally tons of tree branches and debris across Omaha. This caused yard waste to increase by 30% in the city. Some have said they've never, the drivers have never seen so much um, yard waste at the curb, and so it's just really complicating things. So some folks that should have had trash picked up Thursday or Friday just got it out of their way today. Recyclables won't be picked up until at least Thursday. We do not feel like that this is acceptable service. We wanted a plan of action of how that they were going to recover from these delayed pickups. The plan from waste management includes bringing in drivers from other cities and hiring local temp workers to help out, all with the goal of being completely caught up by Saturday. This neighborhood in southwest Omaha was due for a Monday pickup. That didn't happen, and longtime resident Don Scadlin noticed a lot more trash on the curb during his daily walk. I don't ever remember it being exactly like this. But he's not sweating the delays, saying waste management has been very punctual in the past. I don't think we have any valid reason for complaining at all. No, no, I don't think. It's very understandable, very reasonable. That being said, this will cost waste management. They'll lose money from the city for the amount of complaints from residents, as well as for missing pickups. We don't pay them for what they don't do. So they can basically have been hit financially two different ways for the month of May and into June now. And now this all comes as the city is ready to choose a different company to handle trash in the future. Stothert says she would think waste management would still want to do a good job to maintain their national reputation. Reporting in studio, John Kipper, 3 News Now.